Welcome back to Paz's Casa. This is Paz and this is my casa. So, tonight's video is going to be wicked. Off the bat, I uh, watched a video stream of Mr. Bevers. He pulled some crazy stuff for all of us. There's that. Thank you, Mr. B. You are a, a baller and a scholar. And another thing, vigilant viewers, I would like to do a shout out to all my viewers that have been watching for almost eight months. I appreciate each and every one of you. All right, let's start off the list. Got a couple. So we got C Train. Shout out to you, buddy. You are a positive guy. Appreciate you. Then we've got Tim Bister. Eight months. Positive. Dude. Then we've got Jonathan B12. Appreciate you too, dude. Got the paw. All right. Next are some new viewers. Uh, James Burr. Appreciate you, brother. Hope you enjoy the content. All right. Um, CF. Been commenting a lot. I, I appreciate it. Each and every one of you guys, I appreciate it. I'm willing to talk to any of y'all. Uh, Trap Drip is another view subscriber. Thank you. And Alexis C. I appreciate all the female viewers I can get. She's like male. This is not a... This is an equal YouTuber. Equal opportunity. Equal YouTuber something. I like everybody. I'm not perfect. Neither is anybody else. But y'all enjoy this. And I enjoy doing it for you. So, uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching, viewing. Tonight's video is going to be nuts. I'm telling you right now. And we're going to snap right into it. So, uh, here we go. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back to Paz's Casa. This is, this is Paz, and you are at my casa. Welcome. Please come in, take your shoes off, relax, kick back. And watch this stellar video. This is coming to you live. I'm live right now. So it wouldn't be live, would it? Alright, whatever. This is where I picked this lovely goodness up. Tinker and Smithy's Game Store. Middlebury, Vermont. Okay. Right there. Scott's a great guy. Shout out to you, buddy. I appreciate you. Appreciate what you're doing for the channel. There's that. Let him know that I sent you up there. If you guys check it out on the internet, what have you. Alright, he's got these. Right here. These packs will be after, okay? This right here was made in the year. Let's see here. Can we zoom in on that? 2016. I was not into magic in 2016. But I did love it, okay? Oh, before I open this, one thing as well. Before, I never forget him, but, uh, Clever Magic Trevor. Look at that handsome guy right there. That handsome fellow. Get up close and personal. All right, there you are. He sent me a little, a little envelope. Let's have a cup of coffee. And then it says... This note is for is good for a free coffee and a few laughs. I hope we get to have that coffee, Mr. Uh, yeah, Mr. Clever Magic Trevor. And then I opened it up and I found this. Oh my God. That deserves the ringing of the bell. Croxa, Titan of Death's Hunger. That's what's up. Thank you, buddy. I love it. It's going to go right next to the other ones. All right. So this Magic the Gathering lore. It's from the vault, it's called. 
And uh, usually you find them on Amazon, stuff like that, right around 50 to $70. That's what I got it for. 45 bucks at Tinker and Smithy's. They got them on sale or some great promo or something. I don't know. I, um, I'm just ecstatic. I've never opened one of these. So let's get into it. I'm going to pause the cause to get all the all the material that I'm going to need set up so I can run through this and we can get to the cracking of the packs. All right. Pause for cause like Wizard of Oz. And we're back. So I did open this, but I didn't pull the cards out or anything. So this is what it comes in. This beautiful magnetic box. I know Rudy showed them off on his channel. I am not sure if I've seen anybody open one of these, so I figured I'd hop on it before other people did. And this box is to keep. You know, you hold stuff in it. It's it's awesome. Like, it's got two magnets, and it's like that. The cards are sitting in here. On the back, it shows you what comes in the pack. All right. That's awesome. I love it. I'm excited. How about you? Are you excited to see what's in here? Alright. So, let's go with some lore. Oh, wow. This looks like... Ooh. A big butt. Alright, so... Uh, I'm not going to get into all my... All the camera. So, uh... Yeah. It's, it's a big sheet of paper. It covers up my whole playmat. <laughs> it says, many worlds, many stories. The many stories of Magic the Gathering, Magic Multiverse unfold over a multitude of interconnected worlds called planes. Woven through those stories are... Many recurring characters, most notably the world hopping beings called planeswalkers. The earliest magic storylines take place thousands of years prior to the multiverse's present day. And some of them have consequences that still shape the story. Alright, that's what I'm going to read. Not doing the best at it, but it does show you some of the quality cards that are in the pack. And there we go. There's some info on the back as well on what cards are in it. If you don't want to see one, go pick one up. Actually, go right to Tinker and Smithy's and tell them I sent you and you want one of those from the vaults. That'd be pretty cool. Alright, so we've got... The first three cards are just ridiculous. Oh my goodness. All right, I need to sit down. Y'all can see good, I hope. There we go. All right. Here we go. We're not breaking the cards. We're treating them with respect. This might take a little bit, so. All right. How do we do this? Okay, they are packaged. I'm not pulling the little tab. I'd rather not. Okay, so I've washed my hands. You know what? I'm just gonna go through them and then I'll sleep them after for y'all. All right, dark depths. Isn't that beautiful? That's gorgeous. Look at the shine to that thing. Worth a couple bucks. Yes, sir. Alright. So there's one. I'm not sure if all these are mythics or not. Merit Lage Joking. I will put the prices up right next to the cards. Breach the Queen. Mr. Bevers pulled me a Queen Marchesa out of one of those mystery packs. I almost flipped. I was like, oh my goodness. Cabal Ritual. 
Great card. Great commander card. Oh my goodness. And then we've got Conflux. This is my first Conflux card. I'm excited. Five colors. We got Wooberg, baby. Ring the bell for the shine and glimmer. The glimmer is gold, baby. All right, so five cards. Wow. My ankle and my back. Y'all know that song? Sing it with me. First, you gotta put your back into it. Hooked up, just do it, do it, do it, do it good. All right, here we go with the Jite. Umazawa's Jite. All right, back is really sore tonight, along with the ankle. Unmask. That artwork is phenomenal. It will be a little bit for this video, so I hope you guys enjoy it. Let me know, please. I like the way that the, the the foiling is angled. Like I'm definitely putting these in sleeves so they don't curl. I have a feeling these would like to just curl right up into a pretzel or some crap. Glista, the traitor. We don't like traitors. But first strike and death touch, that's great. For three, oh. Blech. Hell Vault. It's dark and mysterious, isn't it? Beautiful. Amazing. Simply marvelous. Memnarch. I wanted this card and obviously I got it now. I love artifacts. Artifacts are my jam, baby. Oh, look at that. There's a seventh card. Wow, okay. Six, two, three, five, six. Okay. Teloria, Telaria West. It's a land. You want to read it? There you go. Pause the video. Okay, now move that down a little bit. Wow, amazing, guys. Isn't this great? This is beautiful. Look at a little die, too. Look at that. And the symbol is obviously the lore emblem or the vault. Beautiful. I like the color. I love the color of that one. Yeah, that's my only one, so I'm keeping it, but I love it. It's so sparkly. Do these dice get you enticed like it does me? Uh, I don't know. I mean, easy to please, I guess, when it comes to the magic cards. Life's been, life's too short to not appreciate the little things, you know? All right, here's our last stack. Mind's Desire. Look at that artwork. Adam. All right, nice job, Adam. I would love to meet some of these artists that think th this stuff up. Mormir Vig. Simic Visionary. Beautiful card. All right. Near-death experience. There we go. At the beginning of your upkeep, if you have Exactly one life, you win the game. <gasps> yeah. Let's do that. Obliterate. Look at the shine. Oh, my goodness. This is great. We're at 11 minutes, and I'm already done with this. Phyrexian processor. Very nice. Amazing. All right, we're going to pause for the cause like Wizard of Oz. Here we go. And I'm back. And we've got these three lovely packs of greatness. Okay? Greatness. Let's go Grammy. And then I'm going to put these right on the cards over there. So they stay flat with a protector on the outside. Oh, can you feel it? Can you? Mm. 
I'm excited. Can you tell? I'm excited that I've got new subscribers. I appreciate you guys left and right subscribing to me. It's so great. I haven't cracked many packs of uh, Take the Crown, but I'm excited to. I think that's all that matters. You know, excitement, you know? Staying positive and paying it forward. You betcha. Hurley Burley. Driver of the Dead. Omen Speaker. Good card. Zealous Strike. Fade into Antiquity. There we go. Ballot Broker. Oh, uh, do we have a foil in here? I think so. Wings of the Guard. Bronze Sable. Uh, two for two one. Not the best. Death Wind. Netscape Spider. I think that was reprinted, wasn't it? Rogue's Passage to start off. Great card. Worth, worth a couple bucks, I think. At least five. Maybe less. I'll correct myself in the video. Rogue's Passage. Starting out gravy. Gravy train. Ascended Law Mage. Not sure what that's worth, but the artwork is phenomenal. That is Ryan Yee. Yeah, I think so. I hope so. Sorry if I butcher your name. Uncommon. Spy Kit. That's in the mystery packs too. Yep. And then we've got Rare Keeper of Keys. Okay. Not sure what it's worth. Pretty gloomy and gloomy. Wind key uh, for five. Three and two blue. Creature, human, rogue, m mutant. When Keeper of Keys enters the battlefield, you become the monarch. There we go. At the beginning of your upkeep, if you're the monarch, creatures you control can cannot can't be blocked this turn. That's pretty crucial. Alright, let's see here. Common. Hired Heist. Is that a foil? No, that's not a foil. And then we've got the Lizard. Alright. Very nice. Next pack to crack. Posse Brown's back. What's good, y'all? What's good? Thank you all for watching. Loving this stuff. This is so great. I do have... Two Throne of Eldrain pre-release kits waiting, wanting to be opened. And if you'd like to get on, in on that, I will. If you'd like to purchase one of those, we can chat about it. I will put my info for PayPal down in the comments below, in the description. All right. And uh, email me. We'll chat. I'll let you know what I can do for the price. You know, I've already had one sponsor, two sponsor videos. By Dr. Cosmo. Thank you, brother. Two thumbs up for you, brother. Alright, so we got Pneumonic Wall, Goblin Tunneler, Child of Night, Cloaked Siren, Custody Peace Keeper, Lay of the Land. Good card. Ghostly Possession. Unnerve. Divination. Very helpful in blue, isn't it? Ravenous. Look. Lucrocata. Okay. That, that creature right there. Here we go. Look at that. Uncommon is a pyretic hunter. That's some sweet artwork. It's an elemental cat. Beautiful. Not sure if it's worth much. Spectral Grasp. There's some Kaya action. Enchantment for two. Enchanted creature can't attack you or a planeswalker you control. Enchanted creature can't block creatures you control. Alright. Gang of Devils. 
uncommon. There we go. Alright. And we've got Rare Gul'daz Spectre. Not sure what it's worth, but that's some pretty kick butt artwork. Alright, so for four, Gul'daz Spectre gets plus three, plus three, as long as an opponent has no cards in hand. When Gruul da draws Spectre, deals combat damage to a player, that player discards a card. Well, alrighty then. Discard a card then. Natural Unity. Beautiful artwork. And we got the Monarch. We are the Monarch, baby. Okay. There's that. Now, let's do this thing, Chicken Wang. Here we go. Y'all know what you can pull out of these packs. It's dirty nuts. Oh my goodness. I'm shocked that I've got one of these packs in my hands right now. Oh, thank you, Scott. Up at Tinker and Smithies. Searing Light for one instant. Destroy target attacking or blocking creature with power two or less. And we've got the little symbol right there. And then we got the regular symbol right there. Which is Oath of the Gate Watch. Raptor Companion. Alright. Uncommon. Ever Dream from Modern Horizons 1. Okay. Exclude from Modern Horizons as well. Let's see here. Krumar Bloodkin from uh, KTK. Uh, I think it's Dragons of Tarkir, right? Carrier Imp. Foundry Street Denizen. Pretty, pretty P.O. Doesn't he look P.O. to you? Take a pill, relax, chill, all right? Just relax. Cathartic Reunion. Appreciate you guys sticking around. Hit the S for super positive. Great people. There we go. New Horizons. We've got some New Horizons coming. Crossroads. Consecrator. Target for one. One and you tap it. Target attacking human gets plus one, plus one until end of turn. Ah, eh, not the greatest. Ooh, Armadillo Cloak. Oh, I wanted one of those. Yeah, buddy. Armadillo Cloak from Ultimate. Oh, Eternal Masters. Very great card. Nice. Rilla Quarry Tower. There's some cha-ching. Some hand size. Gotta love it. Umbral Mantle. For three. It's an equipment creature has. Let's hold it still. Pause. Has. This creature gets plus two, plus two until end of turn. Tap it. Is the untap symbol. Oh, oh, it's showing it. Equip is zero. That's ridiculously awesome. I'll take it. We got a rare Savage Knuckle Blade. Not sure what it's worth, but it's a three. It's a four, four. What's going on with my camera here? All right. Org Warrior. Y'all can see that. There we go. Beautiful. All right. Next on our list. Gorilla Tactics. That's got to be worth some money. 10th edition. Instant Gorilla Tactics deals 2 damage to target, creature, or player. When a spell or ability an opponent controls causes you to discard Gorilla Tactics. Gorilla Tactics 
deals four damage to target creature or player. Wow. And that'd be it. Thank you guys for watching. This has been awesome. I appreciate each and every one of you guys. And uh, don't forget to hit the like, subscribe, and share it. Sharing is caring. And I appreciate each and every one of you. Don't forget it. Um, I'm going to throw in the Reliquary Tower into the giveaway. I'm still throwing in stuff, so it's it's going to get up there. It's We've got a good little amount going. So if you watch the videos, you'll see what's in there. The giveaway pile is getting pretty big. Thank you, guys. And, uh, yeah, if you guys want me to crack one of those pre-release kits open, let me know. All right? And uh, be kind. Tell somebody you love them. And stay positive, dude. Dudettes and other people. Deuces.